Hello everyone, my name is Mad Radio DX UK Mic 7 Echo India Whiskey. I want to welcome you to this video where I'm showing a little invention of mine for um, flat uh, and apartment dwellers that want to do um, ham radio but um, they cannot uh, put out um, an antenna um, and they want a solution so they can carry out their hobby um, you know in their flat or apartment. Well here's uh, mine, might help you too and that is the window frame antenna. All right so I've got here what I've done is I've got some uh, long wire okay I've uh, wrapped around I don't know six seven turns of long wire around this uh, window frame and um, the end of the antenna is I don't know if you can see it stick it out of the window um, and um, yeah and with this I've been able to get reception um, coming in and I've had my signals going out um, and all I can say is I think I mean for me if uh, for the most covert or hidden um, stealth antenna for ham radio I think for up to now this is the best solution uh, for me until maybe I can think of uh, something else but yeah um, the reason I came up with this idea was um, after I did my video um, which uh, Danny Shortwave Radio and DX um, uh, asked me to do um, about uh, showing my uh, ham antennas you know because um, he was saying oh show you know just show your ham antennas um, you know because of uh, for people who are like you, you know, they're restricted um, for installations, they live on the ground floor, they live in the flat and so on. And I thought, well, how about I try something like this, doing this, um, you know, uh, window frame antenna. Will it work? Yes or no? You know, and using just some plain, simple uh, long wire. And yeah, I'm very surprised at the uh, results that um, I've had. Let me just show you. Let's go back to the computer here. So let me just show you here. I was doing the... Um, um the 40 meter band about a couple of days ago with this window frame antenna and this is how many signals i was able to put out in something like um two hours so there you are it does work and um i also had the window in a closed position uh, position which i'll show you um in a moment the other thing as well was i managed plenty of um contacts as well um on the uh with the window frame antenna um, on the 40 meter band I managed uh, a few on the 20 meter band and on the 30 meter band um, I even managed to make um, a contact with somebody there we go there we go Victor Echo One uh, Charlie Yankee Oscar um, I managed to make a contact with somebody in Canada uh, from Canada with this uh, window frame antenna and with the window in a in a closed uh, position so it works really well um, you know very pleased about the results um, it doesn't beat my loop antenna for um, cleaning the noise that I have in the home because uh, you know with all the electrical noise that I have it affects my receiving antennas it affects my ham antennas you know it's just part of you know the, the way th things are um, you know living in modern times that um, a lot of electrical equipment is affect affecting you know radio signals on on the bands but as you can see it does give you uh, results you get signals coming in and more importantly you get signals um, going out now I was going to show you how um, I have my window closed here because this window that I've got you can close it in a secure way but it still um, can have air, a little bit of air coming in so let's just close it like I show you and there we are and then we've got the antenna the end of the long wire still sticking out so you can get reception so yeah, so that's just uh, one solution, you know, uh, for a stealth antenna. I know there are other solutions for a stealth antenna, but, um, you know, I'd be running the risk here, you know, um, getting in trouble with my landlord if they found out, um, things like that. So just something to bear in mind. When you do this, uh, when you're wrapping around, if you want to carry out this experiment and you're wrapping around the uh, long wire around the window frame antenna, you know, I mean, I, I live on the ground floor. I, uh, you know, no danger of me falling to my death, but if you live in a higher floor, be careful what I recommend is you know try and wrap around the um, uh, the long wire around the window frame as close as uh, possible that's uh, one thing the other thing I want to say is that um, the um, in order for this uh, type of antenna to work properly you need an antenna tuning unit either on your transceiver or an external one without one um, it's not going to work and your uh, SWR re reading 
um, standing wave ratio reading is going to go through the roof if you don't tune the antenna um, properly so um, just bear in mind and of course with a high reading high SW, uh, SWR reading um, you could um, eventually damage your uh, transceiver if you transmit constantly all right so yeah um, very pleased the only thing though is that I have found it works from um, from the 40 meter band up to I've tried 10 meter band and it does work on the 10 meter band I haven't tried the 6 meter band because um, I need my Shagu X6100 for that I don't think it will work um, I did try the 80 meter band but the SWR reading on uh, my Shagu uh, G90 here was going through the roof it was uh, it was giving the maximum reading which is really bad so I think what I'll need in the end is I'll need more long wire because um, the thing is the long wire that I have here um, I had to cut it in the end and also it was just 50 meters of long wire left it was originally 100 um, but eventually went down to 50 because the the wire snapped I used to use this uh, long wire tenor when I used to uh, do my DXing um, receiving you know uh, shortwave signals out in the in the field so what I might do is I might buy another 100 meter long wire it only costs about uh, 10 British pounds um, you can find it easily on eBay and so on and um, I think what I'll do is uh, I'll I'll get that 100 meter long wire wrap more wire around the window frame antenna and see if I can eventually do um, things like the um, the 80 meter uh, and 160 meter um, bands um, because uh, my other antennas that I've got the loop antenna and the MFD 1621 they do not cover the 80 160 meter bands I did try with both and they don't work so um, hopefully um, if you know my next antenna like I said if I, if I can get the 100 meter long wire hopefully I can go go on those bands and I'll uh, and I'll give an update so yeah so just uh, an idea a heads up on a on a solution for those that um, cannot have antennas mounted out for any reason from the flats but maybe something like this might work um, after all so thank you very much uh, thank you very much everybody for watching 73s and I'll see you in the next video